latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm 41 Action News anchor Lindsay Shively. Here are your headlines for Monday, November 2nd. Well, tomorrow is Election Day, but if you can't make it to the polls, you can still vote today in both Kansas and Missouri. In Johnson County, the election office will be the only place you can vote in advance today, but only until noon today. If you don't make it before noon, you have to wait until tomorrow. The same is true in Wyandotte County. For Jackson County voters who live in Kansas City, you will need to go to Union Station to vote in person absentee. For everyone else in Jackson County, you need to go to the office in Independence. Clay and Platte County voters will also need to head to their election offices. You have until 5 p.m. today to vote in person absentee in Missouri. If you are voting by mail, all ballots must be received by 7 o'clock tomorrow night. In Kansas, all ballots have to be postmarked on or before tomorrow. The county election office has to receive the ballots by the time they close on Friday. You can tune in tomorrow for the latest from the polls and watch results in real time with 41 Action News. You can stream our coverage online and on your smart TV, too. I'm meteorologist Lindsay Anderson. It's a cold start this morning, so layers will be really important to have today. Start off bundled up. Those numbers are in the upper 20s and low 30s today, and then we'll climb into the low 60s for the late afternoon. Lots of sunshine expected, and our breezes will pick up out of the southwest. We could get wind gusts 20 or 25 miles per hour. Election day tomorrow, and the weather looks great here in Kansas City. 72 degrees will be the height with sunshine, and then more clouds are expected to roll in on on Wednesday, we're still in the low 70s through the end of the week and the start of the weekend. Cooler air is set to move in on Sunday and early next week, and that's when we could get our next round of precipitation. You can get the latest news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.